Do you think now we can we 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 can get the key now? Please. Because the key please. Hey, no touching! Guess I better investigate there later. Oh my god, come on! <laughs> when are we gonna act this key, dude? Dude What about the fanboy? I'm about that kid you saw. If I see him again, I'm taking him down! Nick! Look at her eyes! She's serious! Okay, about the director then. If I see him again, I'm taking him down! Nick, I think she's losing it! Wow, we're getting a... <laughs> I feel like we're getting a whole lot of nothing, dude. I I feel like we're getting a whole lot of no, no, no information from this guy. From... From, like, anyone other than the fact that we met the, uh, you know, the dude who made the, the dude who made the thing. And also, you know, everything else. Like, all we really know is, like, like, all we really got from, like, anything is the fact that there are, is that there are newcomers in the form of the director, Mr. Salmonella. Which is after a meat disease. And we know that the assistant probably definitely couldn't have done that thing. Because she was somewhere else at the time, clearly. And literally everything else at the moment also that involves things. I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. I'm just saying, I'm just saying things now. Like, why, dude? I think we ought to go back... No, we, we, we really can't, though, do we? Okay, oh! Hi! Hello, what are you? What character are you supposed to be? You got a camera? You look mean and nasty? Hey! Hey, wait! I bet he came right through the drain. Hey, um, kiddo, what's your name? Sport? Old Sunny Jim? Old... Buddy, I'm not a kid, so don't talk to me like that. Huh? But you, you are a kid. What a rude little brat. That's no way to talk to an adult. I don't see any adults here. Hippie fashion chick. Hippie fashion? Nick, I think I'm being mocked. You gotta hand it to Maya. She's pretty sharp and pretty mad. <laughs> I'm Cody. Cody Hawkins. Well, Cody Hack. Cody Hackins. Call me Kitty again. I'll cut you down where you stand, evil doer. Oh my god. He's got like a replica sword and everything. What about the Steel Samurai then? So, you are a fan of the Steel Samurai then? How dare you utter that name, evil doer? What do you mean? We're on the Steel Samurai side. <laughs> you can't fool me! Okay, then what's the last line said by the innkeeper in episode 8? Ha! <laughs> Easy. Like some fries with that? Hmm. <laughs> Not bad, kitty -o. Watch it! What are they doing? They're being nerds, and they're beautiful nerds. Say, have you heard about anything about the incident that day? He's angry. Well, you were here, weren't you? Did you see anything? He... He... He always... The Steel Samurai always wins! Always! Yeah, I saw him! I saw everything! What?! But no way am I telling you losers! What? Wait! Let me go! Oh man, she's pinning him down! Pin him down, I say. Also, he's gone. Huh? Something fell off the table when he bumped into it on his way out. A bottle? Why was this sitting here, I wonder? Sleeping pill. Oh, um, oh, oh, oh. Oh. <laughs> okay. Theory, theory time. Theory time. So, maybe 
someone put sleeping pills in, you know, whatever, or someone gave, you know, Will Powers sleeping pills so that he could sleep, but it worked better than normal, so maybe, maybe that's why he woke up so late, as he claims. Anyway, what was that kid saying? He saw everything. Hmm. Well, then. Well. The drain where the fanboy came in. He didn't waste any time coming in, either. Talk about cause and effect. I suppose then we could just go over to... Wait, first of all, the dressing room? Nope. Nothing. The main gate it is, because you can't really get out without him. Huh? Where's that old windbag? Oliver to leave her post. Hey! Nick, that was her! Stop! Whip a snapper! Yep, sounds like she's chasing after that boy. Natch! Uh-oh, she tripped. Maya sure looks happy. All right, uh, let's go now. Let's get the key. Now's our chance. Let's check out the guard station. Good idea. Oh! This is it, Nick. The trailer key. The key to that trailer in Studio 2. We'll be borrowing this, right, Nick? Hell yeah, buddy. Slipped into the pocket. Now let's finally open that freaking door. Jesus. Finally took its sweet time to finally get here. I didn't want to move in there. I want to examine the door. I wonder if the key we borrow from the guard will station will work. It opened. There it is. All right, let's go. Well, you first, Nick. Ah, uh, not that eager. Well, then let's go. October 18th, Studio 2 trailer. Oh, ho, 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 ho. oh, what are you? Eek! Someone's in here. Names? Uh, our names? Well, we're WP's lawyers, and, um, I see. And who might you... D. Vasquez, the producer. D. Vasquez. She's quite beautiful. I kind of like her frames of animation, though, and how... See, I kind of like... I kind of like in this game how, like, everything's sort of, like, limited frames of animation. Because this was originally a Game Boy Advance game. This makes it feel like very old, like, PC game... PC visual novel games or PC mystery games, which... This is technically a mystery game, mind you. But, like, I, I kind of like that. I'm just saying, I, I, I like that a little bit. I was wondering if you could tell me about the day of the murder. Miss Vasquez? Script. I excuse me? Script. I'm looking for a script. A script? The Steel Samurai, episode 13. I need it. Um, can we ask you a bit about the day of the murder? I need to read it. Bro, we're getting nowhere fast. Um, we, we really like to ask you about the Steel Samurai. It's Vasca. Oh my god. It's on TV every week. That's all I have to say about that. Wow, she really just doesn't want to tell us. Maybe the stu maybe like the studio is also keeping her quiet. I mean, she's the producer; she's in charge of everything. But maybe N Nick, she's telling us to go watch TV. The nerve of her! Hey, don't get mad at me. Now about the director, Sal Salmonello, isn't it? Uh, what exactly is his role here? Perhaps I didn't make myself clear. I'm looking for a script. I can't be bothered with anything else. Wow, she's just really focused on her work, huh? Nick? Are all people in the entertainment business this weird? It's 
starting to look like it. Nick, let's get out of here. Isn't there someplace else we have to check? Y yeah. Wait. Y yes? If you see Manella, give him this. Why do you have why do we have to do your errands? Because it's part of the video game, stupid! I I don't think I like her. Don't cry. She'll take it as a sign of weakness. Alright. We'll just give it to him if we see him. Bring me the script for episode 13. Alright, let's examine everything in here. The glass is frosted, I can't see outside this far until October, the dimming daylight makes it feel like winter's coming. I wish winter would stay. It looks like they were designing a set to use this for the Steel Samurai show. They got some figures for some... for. They've got some figures for how much this set costs. I can't believe they spend that much money on those sets. This is where they had that meeting. There are documents and paper cups scattered around. And all these are movie posters. The Singing Samurai started starring Jack Hammer. Who the hell do samurai sing about? Chopping off heads? Oh. My. God. That movie was the best! It's about a samurai who sings his way into fame and fortune! Mr. Hammer was a very accomplished singer, you know. Singing Samurai Stars. What's next, Ninja Ballet? I mean, given the history of Naruto, that might actually happen. Samurai Summer, starring Jack Hammer. This poster's quite old. Wow, it's been years since I saw that show! It's one of those typical summer romance stories, but it was great! A typical summer romance with a samurai on a horse. I mean, I'd watch that. An old movie poster. Dynamite Samurai starring Jack Hammer. I wonder if he was a samurai enthusiast. I guess Mr. Hammer used to be quite a star. Yeah, used to be, but... Yeah, what's in the trash? Nothing here that could be a clue. Just some paper cups and crumpled documents. But maybe what's inside the documents that actually matters... No. No. Okay. All right, then I suppose we can just go ahead and give these whole thingies to, uh, you know, the guy. So let us present this memo to the guy. Here, I got this from the producer. Huh? Bring me the script for episode 13. Episode 13. Where did I put that one? I must have left it somewhere. Sweats. Uh-oh. Uh My ass is pwned if I don't find it. Shakes. Nick. It might be quicker to just look at all the places where he's likely to have been. I agree. Okay, then. Okay. And how about... Again, I, I have the tendency to examine everything. So this is definitely my treat. So if we are to look for the places then, if we are to look for the places, I definitely examined everything in the employee area, so that's all fine and good. And then I also examined everything in the... Uh, I also examined everything in this, in the main gate. So, that's all good. And what about inside Studio One, then? We're back at the scene of the crime. Let's find out what we need and get out of here quick, Nick. Okay, then. Uh, I guess this is probably going to just say the same things. What about here? Oh, it's just a director's chair. The director! Maya! Take a look around that chair for me, would you? Remember that script the director was talking about? Didn't he say he left it somewhere? Aha! Found it, Nick! The script! Good work! 
Aha, so now we can take this to her. One of those Pokemon reports they started filming and then, 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 then. Reflecting light and where's the enthusiasm and we don't need to check anything else at the moment. So all we can really do is just give the script over to the dude who is also a lady. Here, we found it. Your script. Ah. Script handed to D. Vasquez. Or Vasque. Or Vasque. Um, uh. You're not going to talk to us? Quiet. I'm reading. Just you hold on. What's the big idea? Who do you think you are anyway? And, and, do you even know who we are? Powers as lawyers. Um, right. Am I a suspect? N no, it's just, well, no, but... You wanted to know about the day of the murder. Ah ha ha, the music's kicking in. We're getting somewhere finally, please. Yes, anything you could, you could tell us would be a big help. You know there was a meeting here at noon. Yes. With the director and the people from the network. Correct. Now, listen closely. None of the people in this trailer that afternoon went to Studio One. It was impossible for us to leave. Impossible? Why? The path was blocked. The path? Oh, could it be that... Could it be that tree that fell, then? On the day of the murder, the path that leads here was blocked? You saw Mr. Monkey on the way here, correct? M Mr. Monkey? The monkey with the broken head. Oh, right. That. What an original name. Ah... Its head was fell over in the wind on the day of the murder. They didn't start moving the head out of the way until after three. It was after four by the time the path was unblocked. Capiche? Everyone in this trailer was stuck here until the path was cleared. Stuck in this trailer. Stuck until after four. Hammer died at 2.30. Thus, none of us could have gone to Studio One. What? It's true. A crane came just after three to move the head. We called some people in to clear the way. They, I'm sure they cor they cor cor corroborate my story. But but wait. What if the head fell after two thirty? Then you could have gone to Studio One. Two thirty, the time of death. Very well. Come. That's Mr. Monkey. When it wasn't broken, it was it announced the time in ooks. One ook per hour. Ook, 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 ook. Always with the ooking. It is a monkey after all. True. Check its head. The clock inside stopped when it broke. Nick, it stopped at 2.15. 2.15? Oh, 15 minutes before the murder. This pack was blocked from 2.15 till after 4. Therefore, we're innocent. Hammer died in Studio 1 at 2.30. See? Goodbye. Ah, haha, <laughs> okay. What do we do, Nick? There isn't anyone besides WP who could have could have killed Hammer. It's over. We're finished. It sure doesn't look good. Guess we should head back to the office and plan our strategy. I mean, do we just sort of break it to him? Maybe. Well, we can't talk to him anyway. Good. 
We don't want to bring in the bad news that, hey, uh, it turns out that you may have possibly also maybe, maybe have been guilty after all. Now what? We're fresh out of clues. Everyone's out of alibi is watertight. We don't even have any promising leads. I mean, there was that kid who claimed to have saw everything, but, like, we don't know that. Things are looking pretty grim. It's a little early for giving up, don't you think? Huh? You've got one lead. Oh, hey. Okay. I didn't think she was coming. I didn't think Mia was coming back, though. But, okay. All right. M Mia, it's you. What took you so long? Sorry, Phoenix. Maya has trouble calling me unless she's really in trouble. Right. Oh, wait. I guess that means we really are in trouble. I'd say so. What do you mean we have one lead? The boy, of course. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, Cody. Yeah, I saw him. I saw everything. What? But no way am I telling you losers. Tell you losers. Why did I have to spit on my thing? I don't know. He didn't sound like he was going to help us at all. I'm sure you can find some way of bringing him over to your side. Either way, you should go back to the studios. That boy is our last hope, Phoenix. Thanks. For now, thanks. Now I'm more worried than I was before. So what's the best thing to do from here? We need to get back to the studio and talk to the boy. So do you have any ideas we might have done this? We don't have enough information to make a case at. Where have I heard that phrase before? So that's where Maya got it from. Yeah, exactly, man. Exactly. Wait a minute. What if I could... What if I could... Ask her about the movie. Oh, hey! Mia, what's the name of this movie? That movie? Oh! I'm sure I'd like to see that one again. It's... Um... What is it again? S sorry. It's right on the tip of my tongue. Let me guess. It's a suspense thriller. <laughs> oh, wow. Oh, does she have something new to say about the plant? My poor plant! It looks so... so sluggish. Have you been watering it properly, Phoenix? Um, well... Maya has, actually. I think maybe she's giving it too much. Oh, Maya. Sorry, Charlie. Hey! Hey! Let's go! My name is in this game, except it's entirely spelled wrong. It's C-H-A-R-L-I-E, not C-H-A-R-L-E-Y. Thank you very much. The plant's name is Charlie? <laughs> wow, dude. 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 Oh, God, you again. <sighs> huff, puff, huff, puff, huff, puff, huff, puff, jiggly puff, huff, puff. Puffy puff puff. What's wrong? Huff puff huff puff. We we present. She's been chasing that boy this whole time. When when I catch him, I <sighs> sounds like she hasn't had any luck catching him. <sighs> I've I got a hostage hostage now with a zebra. Hostage. Yeah, about the fanboy. Uh, what happened to that boy? If I see him again, I'll... Whew, lay him flat! <sighs> My, what a violent old lady. Actually, I met with the director just now. Eh? Huh? My heart! I don't feel so good. Is she okay? B before I go, I like to... Visit the place where a poor old hammer. Don't tell me she's actually about to die. Where a poor hammer died. Right. She was saying she wanted to visit the studio where he died. What's this about a hostage? <laughs> when that boy was running away, he dropped this and ran. <sighs> 
He'll come back for this one. It's kind of hard to understand her with all that huffing and puffing. Phoenix, that hostage might just be what we need. Cody might talk to us if we give him that. Good idea. Miss Old Limbag, I'll... No! I'm catching that brat if this is the last thing I do. Phoenix, do you have anything we might trade with her? Trade, hmm? I wonder. Anything to trade, huh? I guess the... No, what if we need that for later? This old bag? I'm borrowing this, just so you know. Oh, okay. Just be sure to give it back. She's not, she's not as demanding when she's exhausted. What about sleeping pills then? Huh, huh, huff, 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 huh! Wow, she's really tired, isn't she? She's too busy catching her breath to tell me anything. Yeah, well, yeah. Well, I guess we might as well just see what all this is about then. Let's see, move to the trailer? No, no one's even here. Yeah, no. I guess the employee area might be doing the trick, or maybe in Studio One, actually. No? Okay, employee area it is! Yeah, boy! Employee area, the place where the things happen. Hey! Aww. Hey, you! Wait a sec! Phoenix, was that the boy? Yeah, his name is Cody Hackins. I think he ran into the dressing room. All right, let's go. He's sure to be in here somewhere. Found you! Now lock the door! Damn it, he's getting away! Come back! There, he's back. Wow, how did she... Wow. I guess in the realm of realism, we, we have ghosts who can just trap people in place, huh? Hey there! Would you mind helping us out? Please? Uh, I'm Cody. Hello, Cody. I'm Mia. Mia Faye. Nice to meet you. Yo! And I'm Phoenix Wright. Who asked? Wow, dude. Phoenix, you can take it from here. I'm not so sure I'm qualified. 